Hi friends, welcome to my channel Excellent Ideas in Education. Today we are going to learn about coordinate geometry case study problem. This is board exam important case study problem. Controlling air pollution. The Chief Minister of Delhi launched the Switch Delhi in an electric vehicle mass awareness campaign in the national capital. The government has also issued tenders for setting up 100 charging stations across the city. Each station will have 5 charging points. You see here 5 charging points A, B, C, D and E. For demo, charging station is set up along a straight line and as a charging points. You see here this all is in the straight line. A, B, C and D is in the straight line. Also the distance between C and E is 10 units. So distance of C and E value is 10 units. What we will need to find in this question, you see here 1, 2, 1, 3. This is given or this also we need to find. The distance DE is dash units. So DE distance value we need to find. But you see here E value is not given. Only given is X comma Y. So we can't do anything in this. So what we will do, we will take C and D distance value after that we have to minus with CE DE value got. Now we will proceed the first question. First we will draw the straight line. In this question given a straight line right. So A, B, C, D and E. E is X comma Y. D is 7 comma 7. C is 3 comma 4. B is 0, 7, 4. A is minus 7, 3, 0. You see here C and E value is 10 units. So this value is 10 units. Now we will find C, D value. What is the distance formula? Distance is equal to root of x2 minus x1 the whole square plus y2 minus y1 the whole square. First we will write c value 3 comma 4. 3 is x1, 4 is y1. d, d is 7 comma 7. This is x2 comma y2. So x2 value is x2 is 7, x1 is 3, the whole square plus y2, y2 is 7, y1 is 4, the whole square root. 7 minus 3, 4 square plus 7 minus 4, 3 square root. 4 4 are 16, 3 3 are 9 plus root. 16 plus 9, 25 root equal to 5 units. So, we will got this value. CD is 5 units. This is 5 units. So, what we will do in this case, D is equal to C E minus C D. You see here, C E is given is 10. So 10. C D now we will got this one. C D is 5. So whole distance minus this. This value get right. D E value. So 10 minus 5. So 5 units. So D E value is 5 units. Second one. We need to find X plus Y value. How we will find X plus Y value? X plus Y is you see. E value is x comma y. So we need to find this x comma y value. So what you will do? D is the midpoint of C E. So we will take. So this is 3 comma 4. 7 comma 7. X comma y. So this is x1 comma y1. X2 comma y2. So we will use midpoint formula. What is midpoint formula? x1 plus x2 by 2 comma y1 plus y2 by 2. 
equal to 7 comma 7. So this is the 7 comma 7 comes this side. This is midpoint formula. X1, X1 is 3, X2 is X divided by 2 comma Y1 is 4, Y2 is Y divided by 2 equal to 7 comma 7. Now what we will do? This X and X we will take one Y and Y value we will take. So, 3 plus x by 2 is equal to 7, comma 4 plus y by 2 is equal to 7. After that, 3 plus x, 7 twos are 14, x is equal to 14, this one is goes this side. So, minus 3 equal to 11, x is equal to 11. Y, 4 plus y is equal to 14. y is equal to 14 minus 4. y is equal to 10. They asked for x plus y value. You see, second question is x plus y. So, x is we got 11. y is we got 10. So, 21. x plus y is 21. So, this value is 21. Next, the ratio in which b divides ac. b divides a, C. So, what you will do? B divides AC. The ratio means K is to 1. So, what you will do? K is to 1, third one. What is the ratio formula? Ratio means section formula you will take. Section formula. M1 X2 plus M2 X1 divided by M1 plus M2 comma m1 y2 plus m2 y1 divided by m1 plus m2. I told ratio is k is to 1, right? So, what we will do? Instead of m1, we will take k. m2, we will take 1. So, this is k is to 1 ratio. So, what we will do? We will write m1 instead of m1, k x2 plus 1 into x1 divided by k plus 1 comma m1 m1 is k y2 plus m2 is 1 into y1 divided by k plus 1 in this question the ratio in which b divides ac b divides ac means you draw the line a b c a value is minus 7 by 3 comma 0 B is 0, 7 divided by 4. C is 3, 4. What is x2, x1 value, y2, y1 value in this case? B divides AC, right? So, B divides AC. So, A and C is x1, y1, x2, y2. So, which one is x1, y1? This is x1, y1. A is C is x2, y2. So, we will substitute in this formula. K, keep it K is as it is. K, x2 is 3 into 3 plus x1 is minus 7 by 3 divided by K plus 1 comma. K, keep it as it is. Y2 is 4 plus y1 is 0 divided by k plus 1 equal to b right so 0 comma 7 by 4 you can simplify this one 3k minus 7 by 3 by k plus 1 comma 4k plus 0 divided by k plus 1 equal to 0 comma 7 by 4 you see here, this is x and x, this one, y and y, we'll take this one. So, x and x is 3k minus 7 by 3 by k plus 1 is equal to 0, comma, 4k plus 0 divided by k plus 1 is equal to 7 by 4. k plus 1 is goes this side is 0 only. So, 3k minus 7 by 3 is equal to 0. So, 3 is goes this side. So, 9k minus 7 by 3 is equal to 0. 
9k minus 7 equal to 0. 9k is equal to 7. So, k is equal to 7 by 9. So, here this one 4k is equal to 7 k plus 1 divided by 4. So, this 4 is goes this side. So, 16k is equal to 7k plus 7. So, the k is goes this side. So, 16k minus 7k is equal to 7. 9k is equal to 7. k is equal to 7 by 9. You see here, this two value comes same only. So, we will do only one. This is enough. Otherwise, we will do this one. Which is easiest method? You can take any one. This is x1. This is y1. So, the ratio is 7 is to 9. Next question. Find the relationship between x and y using the point C and E. C and E value is given distance value is 10 units. So, C and E distance value is 10 units. What is E value? Already we got E value of x, y. x is 11, y is 10. What is C value? C value is 3, 4. x1, y1. This is x2, y2. You see this question relationship between x comma y using the points c and e. So x comma y, x comma y you can take it as p. So p c is equal to p e. What is the distance formula? Distance formula is equal to x2 minus x1 the whole square plus y2 minus y1 the whole square root. So, we will take PC is equal to P. So, PC is equal to X2 minus X1 the whole square plus Y2 minus Y1 the whole square root equal to X2 minus X1 the whole square plus Y2 minus Y1 the whole square root. So, this root root cancel. Here you see PC is equal to PE. So PC, so P value, what is P value is equal to X comma Y. This is X1 comma Y1. What is C value? C is equal to 3 comma 4. This is X2 comma Y2. After that, P is X1 Y1. So E is equal to X2 comma y2. What is x2 comma y2? 11 comma 10. So, we will substitute. What is x2 value? x2 is 3. x1 is x. x2 is 3 minus x the whole square plus y2. y2 is 4 minus y the whole square equal to. What is x2? 2 is 11. So, 11 minus x the whole square plus 10 minus y the whole square. You see 3 minus x the whole square is a minus b the whole square. What is a minus b the whole square? a square minus 2ab plus b square. So, what we will do? In this 3 minus x the whole square, 4 minus y the whole square, 11 minus x the whole square, 10 minus y the whole square. All we need to split in this formula. So, a is 3 square minus 2 into x into 3 plus x square. This is 1 plus 4 square minus 2 into a is 4, b is y plus y square. This is second one. You see this is second one. Equal to 11 square minus 2 into 11 into x 
plus x square plus a is 10 square minus 2 into 10 into y plus y square equal to. Now we will simplify this. 3 square is 9. 9 minus 6x plus x square. You see this? 2 into x into 3 is 6x. 2 3 so 6 6x. Plus 4 square. 4 square is 16. 16 minus 2 into 4 into 5. So 8y. 4 2 are 8y plus y square minus 11 square is 121. 2 into 11 is 22x minus 22x. So 121. This is equal to minus equal to 121 minus 22x plus x square plus 10 tens or 100 minus 20y plus y square. x square, here is x square. So, we will cancel this x x square. This x square, this x square will cancel. This y square, y square will cancel. So, what is remaining? 9 minus 6x plus 16 minus 8y is equal to 121 minus 22x plus 100 minus 20y. So, 9 plus 16 is 25 minus 6x. You see here, this is 22x. So, it bring this side. So, plus 22x minus 8y this minus 20 minus is comes this side is plus so plus 20y is equal to 221 220 means 100 plus 121 221 first we will simplify this so 25 minus you see 622 Plus 22 minus 6. So, plus is biggest one. So, you will take plus. 22 minus 6. How much comes? 16. 16x minus. It comes minus or plus. You see plus is biggest one. So, you will take plus. Plus 12y is equal to 221. Now, we will bring it to this side. So, bring it to this side is 221 minus 25. Now, we will write 16x plus 12y is equal to 221 minus 25. It comes 196. 16x plus 12y is equal to 196. 16x plus 12y equal to 196 divided by 4 table. So, 4 means 4 4 are 16, 3 4 are 12. So, 4 4 are 16, 36, 9 4 are 36, so 49. So, 4 x plus 3 y is equal to 49. Answer is 4 x plus 3 y is equal to 49. This is the answer. Thanks for watching this video.